Back in 1987, at the University of Idaho, the Aquaculture Research Institute was created. It was uh, one of uh, President Bill Clinton's last acts in office to sign over, actually, this property to the University of Idaho. It's located right in the center of where all of the water percolates out of the Snake River Aquifer into the Snake River. We do fish genetic work, we do fish nutrition work, and we do um, uh, fish physiology as well. Hagerman is very well known for the research that has been conducted all over the years here. It's uh, very popular around the world as a facility to conduct research on fish nutrition. Uh, the facility here is actually uh, uh, world class or considered world class with respect to um, cool and cold water aquaculture. We have uh, several sets of one third commercial size raceways that we put all of our broodstock fish in. Uh, we have a show pond uh, and a, a large pond that we put all of our uh, sturgeon in. We also have a um, cool water wet lab with uh, 170 tanks. We have a, a quarantine lab. Uh, we have outside uh, tank space as well. Um, we have a dorm on site. We have a fully operational uh, molecular genetics laboratory, including next generation sequencing and all that kind of stuff, and a fully automated you know, office space. The goal of aquaculture, the best quality product in less time while respecting the natural environment. And everybody wants to replace fish meal and fish oil that they are finite resources. So the only carnivorous species that has been raised only in the plant protein with improved performances is only here uh, in University of Idaho. The work that we do here is the exact same problems that they face all over the world. So when we solve a problem here, it translates to helping solve those problems, same problems around the world.